The United States is said to rejoin the Paris Accord under the new administration that will take office next week. Um, as as some, I mean, you 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 were there at the start of Paris. You you gave one of the keynote addresses at the start. Do you welcome this development? Yes, <laughs> I mean it was obviously very sad that the United States hasn't been able to play as much of a part uh, as it was because, of course, many people around the world have always looked to the United States for leadership as one of the, the greatest economies in the world. It's absolutely critical to have the United States involved and playing uh, a, a, a key and essential part. So from that point of view, the fact that it's poised to rejoin, we hope, the, uh, the Paris uh, Agreement, uh, will make an enormous difference, I think, and help to uh, leverage even further support around the world. Uh, so, yes, and I've been very lucky in, in the number of American uh, companies and, as I say, banks and uh, uh, investors, uh, asset managers, who are all now becoming much more enthusiastic about joining in and forming big, uh, a big global alliance. We're trying to build alliances and coalitions of the willing in all the different sectors of the economy. Uh, and these task forces, are, are, I've encouraged them to try right. and find a way to, to, to tackle <laughs> as many of these issues around decarbonization and, the, and uh, the restoration of biodiversity, and all linked to improving people's lives right. and livelihoods for the future.